Hello everybody. So we're back here. Uh, I tried to do a live, but apparently the video quality in live is just terrible. So here we have. Uh, so what I've done is we extracted about a hundred pounds of honey out of these uh, four and a half supers, and uh, so what I did was I just laid it out, let these wild bees come and get them. I mean, some are mine, some I'm sure are wild, but uh, so this is the setup. You just kind of leave them in the grass and or wherever, and uh, the bees will come clean them up. <clears throat> they are a bit aggressive towards each other. There's actually a dead one there. So they do get a little aggressive. Um, you can see here, um, one's kind of attacking the other one. So as long as you don't smell like a bee, I think you'll be okay. I've got one on my finger that I don't want her to accidentally get squished. Just cleaning herself off, getting ready to go back to the hive. There she goes. Let's see if this works. I'm not sure if I can do... Hmm. So yeah, you just extract, um, leave them outside, and the bees will come and clean them up. Um, the reason for doing this is because if you have uh, small hive beetles or especially wax moths in here, uh, they will, if there's any kind of honey or pollen, they will uh, feed on it and basically destroy all the comb in these hive, in these uh, supers. So that is not what you want. So you can see here, they're all just having at it. You can see. That's like brand new comb there. But uh, yeah, bright white comb. And they're just having a field day. They're basically ignoring me, just moving around me like an obstacle. Um, you know, they might bump into you, but they're not, they're not aggressive when they're like this. They're just foraging. So you can stand right amongst them. I mean, I'm three feet away. And they're not bothering me. They just went, one just kind of ran into my ear, but she wasn't aggressive. She just bounced off and moved away. So that's it. Just thought this was kind of cool to see. Um, you definitely want to do this before you store your frames and your uh, hives because they will, um, like I said, the pests will take over. So you want your comb dry. You want. Um, every little out, like drop out of the comb and these bees will do that for you it'll probably take them three to four days but they'll get it done and if you're worried about leaving it overnight you just bring it in at night the bees will keep everything else away from them as long as you don't you know start moving combs around you should be fine well thanks for watching uh like and subscribe and uh, i just think it's really cool i'm gonna try to get a slow-mo video